First at six and only on CBS 46, Georgia vape shops raided. Exclusive video showing officers storming a cannabis distribution center in Gwinnett County. Prosecutors arguing some companies are selling dangerous THC products. But a new lawsuit claims the products are legal. Now businesses involved in that lawsuit are hoping to clear up the confusion. We checked and Georgia law allows for hemp related products to be legal as they have a Delta 9 THC concentration of no more than 0.3%. But there is a gray area surrounding other Delta products. CBS 46's Jamie Kennedy live in Gwinnett County with the story. Jamie. Yeah, good evening, Rick. So many Gwinnett stores like this one here that sell Delta THC products, that's uh, Delta 8 products, they're worried that their inventory is in jeopardy from raids from police and why a lawsuit has been filed and also an injunction to stop any further action. This is exclusive video obtained of Gwinnett officers raiding a vaping distribution centre looking for Delta 8 THC products, which up until recently many in the state thought was a legal practice. From what I've seen and known in the past that it was, it was legal, at least federally, and that certain extent, uh, certain level of THC was illegal. The products give users a very similar high to the one obtained by taking marijuana. Under the Georgia Hemp Farming Act passed in 2019, it says products derived from hemp carrying no more than 0.3% Delta 9 THC can be sold legally. It doesn't mention Delta 8 products, so many have thought them to be legal. The Gwinnett County DA says it is illegal under the Hemp Act and say some Delta 8 products have caused a number of children to have psychotic episodes. The issue is that Delta 8 and Delta 10 are not always derivatives of hemp products. Uh, and even if they are derivatives of hemp product, the legislature was very specific that hemp is defined as something that contains Delta 9 THC in an amount of 0.3% or less. The issue of whether it is legal or not sparking a lawsuit against the Gwinnett DA by retail sellers. I don't believe it is gray. The hemp bill basically legalized all cannabinoids, all extracts, unless we're talking about Delta 9 THC. Those in the business are hoping the lawsuit will bring clarity as the Delta 8 products make up well over half their profits. So far, it's hurt, hurt our bottom line and we're trying to adjust, but most of our sales were coming from the Delta 8 products. So when the distribution centre here was raided, around $2 million worth of stock was taken from them. They say they always have run as a legitimate business, still are running as a legitimate business. The Gwinnett County DA tells me that they are constantly working with business owners on this legislation. Live in Norcross, Jamie Kennedy, CBS 46 News. Breaking at 6. Braves.